What up, Tube? What are we doing today? We are at Nomad Engineering. Got a surprise. Told you I'd be back. They're working on something cool. We're going to go talk to the guys, see what this project is they're working on, and get a little more information about Nomad. All right, so we're inside of Nomad Engineering, and I told you I had a surprise for you. They gave me a call the other day and told me that the 599 Ferrari that's in for the manual transmission conversion or the manual conversion, the word that properly and explain it in a minute, is in. So there it is. So for all that you don't for all of you that don't know, the 599 Ferrari has the same engine as the Enzo Ferrari, but front engine and in a GT touring car style of platform. Very comfortable with all the Enzo fun. Open up here. Now, this has the F1 style transmission in it. So what Nomad's gonna do, or is in the process of doing, and we're gonna follow this along, is they've developed a new center console. So that's the new carbon fiber center console. Okay. They're working on the gauge cluster right now to fix a couple issues. It has nothing to do with the swap they're doing. Um, but they keep the OEM transmission and change the actuator. This is their design. Add a manual transmission pedal to it. So a clutch pedal. This is a raw casting of the unfinished pedal, but this is what it will look like. Obviously, the, the final one will be uh, finished, machined very nicely. Okay, this is the OEM center console. So the one in there is their new design. So they have 3D modeled everything for the 599. They also do it for the 430 Ferrari and the 360 Ferrari and the, a few of the Lamborghinis, which we'll touch on a different video. But, in-house, they design everything, they get the parts made, and they make it work. So, again, when we're done with this, or not we, but them, when Nomad's done with this, it'll have the factory transmission, the F1 transmission. It'll have a new clutch pedal. It'll have a new actuator. It'll have the stock torque tube everything else. So drivetrain from engine back will be all OEM, but all this will be a manual transmission. And you can actually see they've already mocked up the stick shift. They have the new center carbon console in. This is the gate shifter. The gate, I'm sorry. And they may be redesigning the gate depending on how it all shifts when it's all done. But it's going to look almost factory to one of the I believe 30 Ferrari 599s that were built in manual transmission. Very cool setup. So this is what they specialize. It's not all they do but they specialize in these type of swaps. Okay. Or these type of conversions. Swap is the wrong word because they're not doing a manual transmission swap. This isn't a you know SC300 or IS300 going to manual transmission from automatic this is them converting the existing drivetrain on this 599 to a stick shift maintaining the oem drivetrain so very very cool because the oem drivetrain is awesome on this with the f1 tranny on it so we're going to keep covering this we're going to follow the project along as it moves through its stages. Uh, they're doing some R&D work on this right now to try to get some little, you know, it's kind of bugs with something like this. There's no bolt-on kit that you buy to convert a Ferrari into manual transmission, into manual shift. Uh, so uh, they have done a few. And there's three of them. There's three partners. So there's Chris is their designer. He makes everything from scratch in regards to solid work design. All the custom design work needed to use in this and then you have matt who does a lot of the software because there is a module that goes into the ferrari 
to basically let the Ferrari know it's now a manual shift and not automatic shift. So he does a lot of the wiring and the a lot of the you know the the labor work, the wiring, the software, the programming, and then you have uh, Jay who does everything else. <laughs> But they all have a knowledge of this because they've all been designing these type of things for a long time through a couple of other for uh, companies and now they've come together and formed their own company Nomad out of New Braunfels that's doing all this so it's really 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 cool uh, not to mention you have a beautiful car but it's just really cool to see something like this now I asked them the question is there a market for this you know is it just one guy and jay told me no i've done 70 ferraris already or 70 cars ferraris lamborghinis combined okay uh from their design work to now so even though nomad is a new company okay even though nomad is a new company they've done this already through other uh, firms where they've worked at they just come together now to bring it all together in one unit so they can continue developing and perfecting these type of swap now what else are they going to be working on right now we were talking possibly uh, doing suspension arm suspension work for the exotic cars for the Lamborghinis, for the Ferraris, for the Porsches they also love Corvette stuff so they have uh, you know Corvette things uh, what are they going to do on the Corvette we're playing like you see they're playing with the idea of doing an air ride suspension for the c6 corvette something that doesn't involve major body modification and is more of a bolt-on setup to the end user so the beautiful thing about nomad is they design and put into manufacturing all their own components so everything they do comes from they're from scratch from a drawing on a piece of paper an idea in their head so as we continue our you know this adventure and we'll get to see this in the different stages the 599 and we'll get to also meet the owner towards the end once it's actually running and see what other projects they have they were going to be working on all right so i hope you enjoyed this trip it's a, a short trip for me it's not too far from the house so we'll continue uh keeping you posted with nomads awesome builds and awesome engineering and awesome designs i hope you enjoyed this we'll be back soon here have a great week god bless